What's up guys, the haters were finally right about something. There is a part of the drip ecosystem that's dead. The sun has set and this will no longer be used. So for a long time now, you guys have heard, drip is dead, it's not coming back. It's only a matter of time before this thing collapses. Well, that of course is not true. But what is true is there is a piece of the system that we've been using for the last 12 months that is dead. We're killing it off. So everyone take a moment to say goodbye to the white paper. The white paper will no longer be used. It's not as useful as it used to be. This was written and put together very well by some community members a very long time ago, but it's no longer valid. As you guys know, haters are always jumping in here and saying, hey, there's, um, you know, there's little issues with the way this is written in the white paper. And they're utilizing that as FUD to say that X, Y, or Z is not true. So the issues with white papers is, they are images. So and able to just go in and make one little fix, uh, whoever originally created it has to have the format and they got to go in and make the adjustment and then you got to re-upload the, uh, you know, the full image. So this is essentially like a PDF packet that gives you all the details. So that's the old school way to do it. So thank you to the community members who created this in the first place, but we've upgraded. This is dead. The haters are right. There's a piece that's dying. Let's move on to the bigger, better option, which is the new wiki. As you know, wiki is where you go to find information. So this drip community.wiki is where you can go to research all things drip network. So this is the new look and feel right now. I've got dark mode turned on. This is what it looks like in light mode. Some of you guys would prefer that. Um, I am a dark guy, so I'm going to go with the darker mode for my little presentation today, but feel free to flip that toggle and do uh, with it whatever you wish. As you can see, there are a ton of selections here. This is super important. We're trying to go global. And in a lot of cases, some people have uh, misunderstandings because of the language barrier in between different languages. So as you can see here, we've got, of course, English, French, Italian. This is German. We've got uh, Spanish, Portuguese, Chinese, Japanese, Arabic. Chinese probably isn't the right term. It's probably Mandarin, uh, Arabic, and Russian, which is absolutely amazing. There's investors all over the place, and some folks just want to see it written down on paper. In addition, I've had a lot of old schoolers in the comments on my videos say, hey, is there a packet or some information I can read? I'm old school. I like to actually flip through the pages. So this is going to give them the option that if they prefer to read it and not listen to my YouTube videos of me explaining everything, sometimes they need to see it down on paper. Uh, there's different types of learners in the world. Some people learn through reading. Some people learn through listening. Some people learn through kinetics and actually doing the work and everything. So this will give an opportunity for everyone who lives in or who learns in a different way to learn in the way that they prefer. I will post uh, links to this down in the description below. Again, stripcommunity.wiki. It's got a ton of information. I'm not going to go through everything, but we're just going to go through some high level stuff. We landed on the home page here, over here in the corner. My face might be blocking it. I can't see. Let's see. Now, down here in the corner, almost where I'm blocking it, there's a little link to the Telegram, which is awesome. Um, you can click on news and it'll give updated news. Of course, these are some of the medium articles. Um, this is the recent post on Twitter. So I'm assuming that all the new news uh, that comes out, uh, someone on the direct team or from the community that has editing access will be able to add stuff in here. So if you're just looking for the recent news, you can come in here and click the articles. It's hard for me to keep up with Telegram. And I know for you guys, it is too. You get in there, Telegram's not the best platform for communicating. So you gotta scroll down through the last 100 messages to try to get information. And hopefully you don't miss the article that got posted that you wanted to read. So this will be a one-stop shop resource where you can capture that stuff a little more easily. So there's the news, charts and tools, I think is super cool. This isn't just a resource for Drip, it's for the full Drip ecosystem, so Drip community. So you've got information for Drip, you've got Drip Garden, of course, Piggy Bank, Reservoir, and the dogs. I'd be willing to bet that uh, once the farms actually go live, you'll see some additional information here specifically about the farms, because those work just a little bit differently than just standard dogs, standard pigs. And that's the beautiful thing about this. When this needs to be updated, someone just needs to come in, change the text, and it's fully updated for everybody. There's no changing images or uploads or anything like that. So this is gonna be a much, much better real-time resource than we've had in the past. I've seen a couple other major platforms do this, and I think it's really, really useful. Plus myself, I know the other YouTubers, all of our admins in the group, we're constantly answering the same questions. And while we're perfectly fine with that, we'd love to help out. It would be nice to be able to point people directly to a resource, especially when there's a language barrier. We get hit up all the time in our Telegram groups, I know all of us do, with someone who's from another country who's trying to figure out a concept 
and they're just not understanding exactly what we're trying to say, this will be extremely helpful. We can say, hey, if you speak Portuguese, I know you're struggling with the communication that we're doing back and forth, go to this white paper. Here's where you would find the answer. Read that, and if it still doesn't make sense, come back to me. So it'll alleviate the work um, a little bit on our, our part because it'll allow us a place or a direction that we can take people to to where they can learn on their own. And then of course, we'll all continue to do these videos because it seems like they, they do pretty well. So let's dive in a little bit, not too much. Um, if we look here, we went to charts and tools, we've got drip, we've got live charts, utility charts, advanced charts, calculators, I mean, this stuff's awesome. And what I think is really cool is they used a lot of stuff that uh, community members had created, all these different tools that we use out there, they put them in here. So those guys get their credit, people can use uh, their resources and the resources are all available in one area. So I think that's really, really important. As you can see, you've got the drip chart, BNB chart, which is awesome. B Reap currently trading at 110 bucks. Listen, if you plan on building a team and you have a reasonable amount of capital, pick up at least two B Reap tokens and just hold them in your wallet. This should go back up. Um, I want to say at one point this was B, B Reap was trading for like 450 bucks or something. It was it got pretty high. And I can imagine there, there's an easy scenario, an easy case. Once everything gets rocking again and we get into some sort of a bull market, that B Reap tokens are going to be a thousand bucks a piece. So it's going to cost you two grand to even be in a position to be able to build a team. So plan ahead, pick some up now. That is a sleeper play. Not a lot of people are talking about it. I heard a couple of people mention it, and I've mentioned it on a few previous videos, but try to compile a little bit of B Reap just so when the time comes, if you want to build a little team, you got friends and family. Once the charts start going up and to the right, whether it be pigs or dogs or whatever it is, people are going to want to jump in. So your friends or family, they're going to see you making money and they're going to be interested. The only reason they're not interested right now is because people don't buy value. They want to see a chart going straight up so they can get that FOMO to get in. And that's not the best, best time to invest. As you know, you want to invest when no one else is interested in it and you want to sell when everybody's interested in it and your barber's telling you about Drip Network. So just keep that in mind, you know, you purchase while the prices are low, people are going to want to flood in as the charts are looking better. So just prepare yourself for the future because I think everything's going to pop off before too long. And you got utility charts, uh, which is awesome. Again, this is dripnetwork.ca. There's the link to it, a fantastic tool. Onto advanced charts, you can use the selection over here on the sidebar or this one. This is Dune Analytics, another fantastic tool that you should be utilizing. Good to see this all in one place. And then of course, uh, dripfi.app. Dripfi.app is one of the best calculators out there and it really helps you understand um, you know, where you're sitting with your, with your drip investment. If you guys aren't using uh, this one, of course, click this link that's here, uh, but you've got auto price, which will help populate the, the actual price right now. And then deduct taxes, if that's checked, then the numbers you see over here are already gonna be with the taxes deducted. And I don't know if you're seeing this, this is just a standard wiki page, but look at this. This is my actual information. So I'm betting that when you go to it, you'll actually see your information. You can play with this. So this is actually live on screen, which is which is kind of wild. So fully, fully uh, integrated, fully interactive. It's very, very cool. Uh, Drip Garden as well. 30,000 players. You've got the charts, the amount of LPs, everything. Uh, of course, you've got the details as well uh, from Dune on Piggy Bank. The Reservoir, which is going to be interesting to track. Here soon, I think there's going to be a lot more information um, on here. I think they're going to, when they do the, the Layer 2 or Version 2 of Drip, they're supposed to gamify the Reservoir a little bit. So I think this page will get built out and it should describe exactly what they're doing. So I'm excited for that Layer 2. I really like all the bricks and, and pieces that are building this big castle that is the, the Drip Network ecosystem. And I think that Layer 2 is going to be a cool play. Dogs, obviously dogs aren't live yet, so that's not available. You've got access to the Drip Community site, Animal Farm site, Fork Shark Calls and Telegram, make sure you're following that. Like I said, the live charts as well. I think somewhere on here, it might be in news, or down here, credits and info. So um, what this has got is a few things. One, the Wiki Dev, Ricky SP, shout out to you. Congratulations on, on uh, making this look so clean. I really like it. And I think it's gonna be a phenomenal resource for everyone couple of experts here and then uh, special thanks to Ray over at Bartertown. A few things that they're going to add on here. Look, uh, add how-to uh, tutorials step by step. I'd like to um, I'd like to collaborate on that. I'd like to get a couple of mine in there. I could even go back and make mine a little cleaner that are just really specific step by step for what it is. 
Um, sometimes I go off and I talk about my own personal experiences or whatever a little bit too much, but that might be uh, just specifically for my YouTube channel. But I wouldn't mind jumping on here and putting in some of these uh, because I like to think, and at least from what my comments say, I describe things and explain things in a way that's more easily understood. So it'd be cool if I could put a, a couple of how-to tutorials on here. Go over to English, go to Drip. You've got Introduction, Explains the Faucet, Swaps and Liquidity, reservoir team roadmap like the roadmap for instance for drip which i think is super cool here's all the stuff they've knocked out so we are making progress even though it's been slow october 18th animal farm v3 launches which it's the third version of the ui and all that and so technically it, it is the third version of the animal farm we, we all consider it v2 because it's only the v2 version of the dogs and the pigs so November, we've got the um, Dogs of Fortune game and of course the Dogs Roulette launch in addition to the Drip UI, which I am incredibly excited about it. I don't know why I'm so excited, but um, I'm pumped for that one. I think it's gonna bring the ecosystem together. So when you look at them side by side, you can see, hey, these could be in the same family. Right now, Drip's like the ugly cousin in Animal Farm, you know, is the, is the hot one. And the other thing I'm super excited about is Scratchy. I'm pumped, pumped, pumped about Scratchy. I can't wait to do some DGEM plays. I wanna scratch these things live. I wanna do some giveaways. I'm just, I think there's a whole brand of content and, and level of content that we can put out directly on Scratchy. And I think it's gonna bring people in that aren't interested in a daily ROI platform and just wanna buy something and scratch it. I mean, it's instant gratification. And I think a lot of people want instant gratification. I think even in this DeFi space, people expect to make a quick buck. And when they realize, you know, drip, and the animal farm, the full ecosystem, are all really longer term plays, then they get a little bit less interested. So maybe scratch tickets is a thing for them. And that's gonna eventually onboard a bunch of new users. So that's cool. And then of course, a bunch of other stuff going on. Lending protocols, insurance, fiat on ramp, all that type of stuff, super, super exciting. So I won't spend any more time on this, but I recommend going to this website using the link below. I'll paste that. What I'll also do is I'll paste the Telegram link. So they've set up a specific group in Telegram that's directly for the Drip Wiki page. Page. And in there, you can chat about stuff. You can make recommendations of stuff you want to add. If there's an issue and there needs to be an edit, you can put that in there. This really is a community project. And I think this just really cements that. It brings it all together because now the community can go into that group and say, hey, this isn't making sense for me. And if a lot of other community members say, I'm having the same issue, then the powers that be can go and make adjustments so it makes more sense. If there's an error, it can easily be fixed. If there's something phrased in here the wrong way and so the Futters would pick it up and say, hey, this actually doesn't work like that, we can easily get it adjusted. And those problems all of a sudden that blow up into big things that are tiny in the beginning can be easily solved before they start being an actual issue. So this is a grown-up tool, a grown-up website, a grown-up wiki that is very on brand for the new professional ecosystem that we've got lined up. Quick update before I let you go, let's jump over and look at the prices. Guys, if you like my content, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Earlier this morning, I was at 4,444 subscribers. So thank you to each and every one of you who watches the content, likes, and subscribes. So if you're not subscribed yet and you look down on your YouTube channel and you're watching this and that little button is glowing red, please hit it, subscribe. I promise to produce good content that'll actually be meaningful for you. All right, my personal account is up to uh, getting close to 6,400 total deposits, which is awesome. Right now that equates to about 45,000 in USD. If we go over to the price, man, Drip is just sticking to this $7 price. It really has been acting like a stable coin, so that's awesome. I mean, even it, it, I want it to go higher, we all do. But even at $7 on a max wallet, that's really good money. Almost every one of us could retire on that type of passive income. So uh, the chart's just been up and down. Every time it dips down just below under seven, big buys come in and boost it back up. So this is a fine. I fully expect this to double here soon. I do think that a lot of the capital, since the marketing efforts are steering people toward the animal farm, a lot of the capital is going to go into pigs right now. We should see some additional capital going into the garden, so that'll help drip because of liquidity. When the launch happens, a bunch of money is going to get parked into dogs. But at that point, I think people are going to look at it and say, I can pick up drip for $7. This ecosystem's been running for 17 It'll be like 18 months by then. This seems like a good play to me. That'll increase uh, the demand and, and that'll increase the price. So anyway, guys, like I said, I'll post those links down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you think there's anything need to be added. I'm happy to ask them about it. I want to make sure that that resource is fully functional and it helps us all out as we continue to grow this community. So thank you guys for watching. Happy investing.